Taiwan's first completely self-pay clinic is slated to open for business later this year. Meanwhile, health care for foreign students and senior citizens is also expected to see some changes in the upcoming months. The nation's first self-pay clinic is set to open for business this May under the leadership of Li Yuanda, a veteran cardiologist and a former superintendent of NTU Hospital. The clinic is touting its facilities as on par with regional hospitals and will limit the number of outpatients to three to six per session. Each consultation, however, will cost around 12,000 NT dollars out of pocket. Around 300 students have signed a petition in protest at the government's plan to let Chinese students in Taiwan join the national health insurance system by hiking monthly premiums across the board for all overseas students of Chinese background. Those students from Hong Kong, Macau and other places would all see their premiums increase from 749 to 1,249 NT dollars under the plan. To address the difficulty that many of the island's senior citizens encounter without elevators at their apartments, New Taipei has rolled out new stair climbing machines to help its elderly residents ascend and descend stairs more easily. The machine can be rented for 5,000 NT per month, while a one-time rental will cost 800 NT. Low-income senior citizens will be able to rent it free of charge.